Hey everyone, it's Xander, and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank, a crack in time. So, um, man-eating monster things. They waste no time going for you. Yeah. What did I tell you? A leap of faith. Oh, great. General, wait! I have a feeling that's going to kill me more than the other stuff is. All right, here we go. General, will you just stop for a second? I want to know what happened. <laughs> questions, questions. You ask all these questions. Ask yourself this. How relevant is the past when it can be changed? Your father would have said not very. That's him. And you still haven't given me a straight answer. Now why aren't you with the Lombaxes? Because I failed them! I failed them. I made a mistake. After the Great War, Polaris was a dangerous place. Even with the Kragmites gone, I knew steps needed to be taken to protect the galaxy. One day, we were approached by an inventor with incredible ideas, technology, light years beyond what we were using. The inventor was someone... someone your father warned me not to trust. Our kind had grown suspicious of him, but I was convinced this was the right thing to do. For the galaxy, I granted him full access to our technology, all of our secrets. Only when he was finished, they took refuge in the court, but your father refused. He would never have left your mother. But when he made it back, she... She was already gone. I don't know how long he survived before Takian caught up with him. But I know I was responsible for his death. For my crimes, I was forbidden from joining the Lombaxes. And so, I live in exile. I can make it right, Ratchet. All of it. I... We can fix it. With the clock under our control, it'll be like none of this ever happened. Stay with me, and I promise I'll get your family back. Problem. We've already been told we can't use the clock like that. This is going to be awkward. For now, all we can do is try and stop Nefarious. We're on the same page there. You must help. The Agorians have launched a full-scale assault on the settlement. Our kind has barricaded themselves in their homes. We have no time for petty squabbles. Ratchet, remember the mission. The Obsidian Eye is all that matters. The Eye? It's in a temple. I can take you there. Please. We are not an aggressive race. Help us defeat the Agorians and I'll show you where it is. Might as well. I could use some experience on my weapons. And they're just going to get in our way anyways. This is where things are going to get interesting. Can I buy my new armor? Nope, it's still coming soon. At least I'm full on health. Well, let's have some fun, shall we? Let's have some fun, shall we? Let's test out my new sniper rifle. As you see, giant glowy spots. I'm a bad shot. What a surprise. Dang, that makes that. Whoa, oh god, he's really pissed. Hey. Can I get him through here? Yep. That works. 
Also, good to know I'm at full health again. Way to start off this fight, huh? So, we have to take out five of these raider things, I guess. That's the best way I know how to describe them. Whoa! Okay! Spike the balls of doom. Man, they ain't laying up for nothing, are they? I love sniper rifles. I'm out of ammo. Guess we're doing this the old fashioned way. They still that sniper ass glamour, but oh well. This has to be great experience for these weapons. Aha! More enemies! Avoid breaking mistakes. Red mistakes make them go berserk. That's not good. <laughs> Too late. Broke it. I'm gonna one of these guys out. Good, good. Yeah, I've almost maxed out the this thing now. What the hell hit me? I better get some damn health. Yeesh. Enemies everywhere. Yeah, good for you. I'm not a synthetic life form though, so yeah. I'll just take every last bit of health I can get my hands on right now. Do I have any? No, I don't have any ammo for it yet. Explosives fix all my problems. That's what I keep telling myself. Well, I certainly killed all them. And I have no more of those. Come on! I got plenty of ammo. Is everything here? No, they just keep sending them. Time to bail. By all means, I probably should have died there. Jeez. Crazy drivers. Last thing I got to destroy is up here somewhere. Get another one out. Oh, right in my face, are you? Ooh, I loaded it up, by the way. Genetically mutated weapon is now bigger, badder, and quite frankly, uglier. 
I think they said that it basically does more damage now. Uh, sorry, fear went dark on me for a moment. I like to be able to see what my... I'm capturing, make sure I don't have a bunch of drop frames. Let's see Mr. Stoker now. Is he leveled up yet? How much more do I need on him? I'm just gonna keep using bombs on everything. I can't use bombs on everything now. Great. Well, I got some nanotech upgrade. Can't argue with that. Congratulations! Your synthenoid is upgraded to Sir Kind of Destroyer. Your mechanical bodyguard now comes with an explosive fusion cannon and rapid fire capabilities. Well, that answers that question. I am really running out of ammo. Aha! There's the guy I got to take down. They should make really short sure work of it. Some heavier firepower. Wait here. I'll cover you from the sky. Hydro tanks. Just what I wanted to see. If I remember right, I had to rip off their individual parts. Also, uh, thank God for ammo stations. Welcome back, Chief. I will take all that maximum ammo. That's right for if I want to launch myself back. Can I get up on that ledge? That'd be wonderful. You are going to be a useful sniping point for me. When explosions are going off in my face. Come on. That's, yep, totally shooting at me. But I caught that. So each of these things is going to be a boss fight, basically. Time to run. That. Guess we're doing Tesla spikes. I'm just gonna try and keep it distracted over here without it spewing fire on me, preferably. Just another one down. Come over here and get zapped. Moving in for what? It doesn't listen to work. Alright, that's one down. Looks like we've got one more hydro tank. Check your nav unit. Also zoning. No, now is not the time to play hide and seek with me. Zoni, you have the worst timing in the world. Seriously. Oh god. Uh, no, 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 not find the hydro tank, Zoni. This is a terrible idea. Where the hell is it? 
I'll be snagging this, and then I'll be taking that battery by that door. Sorry guys, I know I totally am supposed to be helping you out right now, but I'm easily distracted by things. That gets me, I think, zoning number two. That gets me a hollow plan for the Rhino. I'm still kind of mad at the Zony because this is all their fault, but they certainly are helping me out now. Also, there's 10 parts to the hollow plan. Good to know. Now, where was I originally going? I guess anywhere down here works. Alright, I think there was a thing down here that I was going to kill. Yeah, it's right there. Yep, I actually went down here to fight this thing. You do that. Oh, that's all my spikes. There's one down. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna keep back flipping around you. Oh, and you have back. Oh, that's wonderful. I have backup too. Just keep zapping it. There we go. Where's my grapple point at? There we go. That's why I need to rip off. I've almost leveled this thing up. Come on, Dynamo of Doom! It's, it hit level 2, just hadn't shown me the thing. There we go. Damage and area of effects. Definitely good things to upgrade on this one. I think it's pissed at me, guys. Where is it? Where's the thing? Gotcha. Only two Hydra tanks? I thought there were three. Use fusion turret. Shoot down to. Oh boy. I need positions. Coming then. Stand by for nav sync. Oh god! In my face. Just right there. pissed at me if I fire some me. And I have a limited number of missiles. That's great to know. I think little pricks, aren't they? How about no, guys? Damn it! Ah, I was always bad at this section.
I gotta kill entirely too many of these things. Not good enough, I'm kind of dying here. The next one's coming in at right in front of me. Barely did that. Why can't I fly around and shoot yeah. things? Droopy Yard is indeed. I am almost dead. I seriously need to not die. Can I buy armor yet? Nope. Sweet health. Sweet, sweet nanotech. Happy to be of service. However, there is the matter of guiding us to the obsidian eye. Of course. Naturally, I can't take you there myself. Far too treacherous for me. But here is something to help you through the caves. Ooh. We closed these caves off years ago. Too many dangers, too many deaths. Grab that Omni Soaker will ward off the Tetramites. Oh. We have a thing to help us. Right in there. Looks like the door rusted right off its track. I'll try to get it fixed, but then uh, it might be a while. Try breathing real shallow like. <laughs> Thanks. Well, looks like the only way out is in. What do you think? Should we give that Omni Soaker a try? Press R1 overwatch you fill the Omni Soaker. I am over water. I guess this isn't deep enough water then. Or I just wasn't ready. Oh! The targeting radical has to be over. Okay. And I use on these plants to uh, beef them up. To admire bullet engineering, that Omni Soaker can suck up almost anything. Water, nectar, <laughs> even oil. So it's like the flood thing from uh, the very first game, I think. See that? Precus Wormroot produces a sugary nectar the Tetramites can't stay away from. Try your Omni Soaker on it. So now I can make these idiots go over, say, here. What did I tell you? They love it. And they'll ignore me, so I can eat over here. That nectar makes an excellent tea. Now I just get water again. They'll go for me, but they can't stand water. This thing seems to have unloaded shots until I switch to something else. So, lots and lots of puzzle solving. Come on, Rackett. Yep, there they the are. Great clock awaits. Now, here's a fun trick. Shoot the nectar onto there. And watch what they can do to anything without it being us. Uh, 
I'm shooting that there just in case. Because, yep, there's more of them. I'll be willing to grab this and get the hell out, like, now. So there's that taken care of. There's water right where I came in at, just in case. Yep. They waste no time. So based on the symbol in the core, you can see I either have nectar or I have water. In this case, it's nectar. You can also see inside this thing what I'm using. You go for that, not for me. Yeah, that's even that nest is horrifying. That's Bolton Ivy, a living organism impervious to any munition in the known universe. You'll have to find a way to scare it. Why does that thing get to go up there? So can I just aim that up there? There we go. So it's two zones I've got in this world now. I want to make sure I was counting that right. Bravo! Go on ahead. I'll find another way around. And honestly, I'll just be jumping here where I'm safe. There's nothing down there but death, as far as I know. That doesn't help me at all. I need them to go over there. This isn't working out at all for me. They're just little monstrosities, aren't they? Alright, plan is this. Jump up there, shoot that, jump back down here. These things take some time to respawn these things once they break those. So I can go through without having to worry too much right now. I wanna know what path you took, you jerk. I gotta deal with these things trying to eat me, and this is my only salvation. A water gun. We have a problem. The wench crank for that mining platform is right next to a tetramite nest. We're too close to turn back now. Got any more of those flares? Be careful down there. Awesome. Bombs away. Yep, there they are. Never fails. Let's hope that lasts long enough for me to do this. Nope, it doesn't. That's probably one of the worst ways to die in a Ration Clank game ever. We have a problem. The wench crank for that mining platform is right next to a tetramite nest. We're too close to turn back now. Got any more of those flares? Be careful down there. I need to figure out how to basically turn this and stop it without them coming after me. Because that I don't remember how to do. Because yeah, they just get pissed off and want me dead again. Maybe if I just fire a few shots at this crap. How many of these things can I have up here at once? Alright, I got three globs of this crap. Hopefully that's enough to save my ass. You did it, Ratchet! Well done! Come on! The obsidian eye is right this way! 
So glad I have that nectar down there. Jeez. Be switching this out for water. And let's switch this back to nectar because I'll probably need it for something. Do you realize that we are just hours away from reversing the greatest tragedy in the history of the universe? Your mother, your father! They'll both be right here, safe and sound! You really think the clock can save them? <laughs> of course! That's what it was built for! Come on! He's just right ahead, not paying attention to where I am. I think I'm up on my time limit, though. Sorry, I've been getting super quiet in this part, haven't I? My bad. Yeah, it's 31 minutes, guys. So, I'm actually going to cut this here. In the next part, we're going to get to the end of the Vongo Caves. Uh, if you guys have enjoyed this part, enjoyed seeing us find a way to deal with these horrifying monstrosities trying to eat me. Enjoyed us saving the civilians of this planet. If you've... Excuse me. If you've enjoyed all of that, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, share it with your friends, leave any suggestions in the comment section, and I will see you guys later.